Yesterday we went to the AD office and got our tickets to the next destination. Traveling around Mexico, you're going to become intimately familiar with the ADO ticket office. The ADO buses are a really nice, cost-effective way to travel all over. When we got done, we had $2 left in our daily budget, so we ate leftover peanut butter sandwiches. Yum. <laughs> very tasty, not very exciting, so we skipped ahead today. <laughs> we headed out south of town to check out cenotes and you can't really get to them without going to a beach club, which is about anywhere from 25 to 35 paces. We've heard the best way to get access to the cenotes is on a boat trip, and that appears to be true. Beautiful yeah. walk, though. Yeah, lots of animals. Yes! You should have seen the chicken. I'll get a picture of him. Yeah, she won't. He's gone. I know, probably. Cenote, cenote is 25 paces. Yeah, that's right. and saw this cute little boy who was selling cookies and cheese. So I got the oats cheese, uh, cookies, but... He's not gonna hold that bottle of water, dear. Well, it's not that, I just can't. He tied them really well. 20 paces, or three, or 50 paces. Oh. Okay, it's like an oatmeal cookie. These are really good. It is an oatmeal cookie. Yeah, but you know, in other countries, they taste all different. It has honey in it. Oh, this is good. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this. 20 pesos well spent. Don't get us wrong, it's definitely worth a couple of bucks to get into the cenotes or into the beach clubs. There's just some free spots right up near town that are just as pretty to swim in. Like this one. I'm just gonna add this to the wide range of things that does not suck. <laughs> Today, so we're checking out the market. Haven't done a market tour in a while. This is really cool. Definitely more for locals than tourists. It's my kind of market. Culture Trip said check this place out, so we're gonna have lunch. This is much more than a restaurant. <laughs> Overall, what do you think of the place? I love the ambiance. I had the falafel. It was just okay. Charming little place, a little pricey, but okay. Wow, Bacalar has not failed to impress. Just a lovely little town. I can see why it's gotten the Pueblo Magico designation from Mexico. Super charming. It's peaceful and the people are really nice. And there's usually not car alarms going off. <laughs> no. Love it. Definitely recommend to visit here. Yes. Take
thumbs up and subscribe. So now that was good. That was good. That was good.